One day, Pinkie Pie invited all her best friends over to celebrate Gummy's birthday. You always throw the best parties, Pinkie Pie, said Fluttershy. After the party, Pinkie Pie waved goodbye to all her friends. Bravo for hosting yet another delightful soiree, said Rarity. See you later, birthday alligator, said Rainbow Dash. Great party, said Twilight Sparkle. I haven't danced that much since, well, since your last party, said Applejack. We should do this again soon, smiled Twilight Sparkle. We should do this again soon! They would, in fact, do it again soon, because all the ponies were going to throw a surprise party for Pinkie Pie the very next day. The next day, Pinkie Pie showed up at Twilight Sparkle's door. She wanted to have another party for Gummy right away. But it was the same day as her surprise party. You said we should have another party soon, and it's soon! Here's your invitation! Thinking fast, Twilight Sparkle made up an excuse and told Pinkie Pie she could not come to her party. I wish I could make it, but I've really got to hit the books, said Twilight Sparkle. Pinkie Pie galloped to Sweet Apple Acres so she could invite Applejack to her party. Who's ready to shake their hoof thing? Applejack could not tell Pinkie about the party they were planning for her, so she made an excuse, too. I can't make it. I have to, uh, you know, um, pick apples, said Applejack. A party is still a party, even if there are only three guests, said Pinkie Pie. So off she went to the Carousel Boutique to invite Rarity. Gummy's after birthday parties this afternoon. Rarity did not want to ruin the surprise party for her friend, so she made up an excuse too. I have to wash my hair, said Rarity. Pinkie Pie went to deliver her invitations to Rainbow Dash and Fluttershy. We're house-sitting, uh, for a bear, said Rainbow Dash. They said they could not come either. No ponies were coming to Pinkie Pie's party. There's a bear around here who lives in a house? Pinkie Pie was confused. Why could none of her friends make it to Gummy's after-birthday party? Something strange is definitely going on around here, Gummy. 
Meanwhile, Twilight Sparkle trotted over to the sweet shop to pick up the cake for Pinkie Pie's surprise party. She reminded Mrs. Cake that the party was a secret and not to tell Pinky. I don't want her to know anything about this, said Twilight Sparkle. Pinkie Pie felt sad because Twilight Sparkle was keeping a secret from her. But we're friends. What wouldn't Twilight want me to know anything about? She wanted to discover what was going on. Pinkie Pie put on a disguise and followed Twilight Sparkle as she brought the cake to Rarity. I'd hate for her to ruin everything, said Rarity. <laughs> she didn't see me at the sweet shop, Twilight Sparkle whispered. Pinkie Pie followed Rarity and saw her pass the cake to Fluttershy. All her friends were planning a party without her. Can you believe she was planning an after-birthday party today? said Rarity. I'm just glad I was able to come up with an excuse said Fluttershy. I thought every pony loved my party, Pinkie Pie said to herself. Just then, Pinkie Pie noticed Rainbow Dash with a bag of supplies. She wanted to know what was in that bag. Pinkie Pie chased Rainbow Dash all the way to Applejack's barn. Pinkie Pie banged on the door. I know you're in there! You can't come in here, said Applejack. Pinkie Pie threw a party for Gummy without her friends. She invited some pretty strange guests instead. My dad's got my elf in this little slice of cake! I'm having a delightful time as well! This is one great party! You really outdone yourself! Could I have some more punch? Rainbow Dash tried to convince her to stop acting weird and to come with her. What do you say we get out of Creepy Town and head on over to Applejack's, said Rainbow Dash. Her surprise party was waiting, but she did not know that. I'm having a wonderful time right here. Rainbow Dash had to shove her into the barn, where everyone was waiting to give her a big surprise. Surprise! yelled all the ponies. It was Pinkie Pie's surprise birthday party. The ponies had been planning it for so long. Yes, it's my birthday! Oh, how could I have forgotten my own birthday? We had to make up excuses for why we couldn't attend Gummy's party so that we could get everything ready for yours, said Rarity. They had kept it a secret from Pinkie Pie so it would be a nice surprise. We wanted your party to be a surprise, Happy said Rainbow birthday, Dash. Happy birthday, Pinkie Pie, said Twilight Sparkle. Pinkie Pie felt so happy. You girls are the
she said. Let's par-